Hey guys, I'm here with a video today. Out of the blue, but uh, recent couple of days I put on posts on Instagram uh, saying what would you would like me to do on YouTube. Yes, I know you can't properly see my face because the sun is like banging at you, so. Oh well, but uh, as I was saying, I asked you what you'd like me to do. One mate asked if I could do a video about exams. Currently we are in, in exam season at the moment, so basically tips for exams, well, well preparing for exams, it's a bit too late to prepare for them, but uh, I was just going to say it anyway, preparing, you just got to revise really, other people's got, uh, other people got like different kind of learning techniques like uh, watching videos of YouTube, or maybe just uh, reading the books or rewriting their notes, stuff like that. Just keep on revising, but don't do it 24 7 because you're just gonna make yourself like completely mess yourself over because you're putting too much. Like, you have to have at least free time as well because you can't just always do revision because you just won't actually succeed. You have to have time before you can chill out, like, have some time. But not just the worst 24 revision, but like 24 7 revision and stuff. Uh, phase 2 actually going through the exams now, like during the exam week, stuff like that. Don't, like, after every exam, don't like uh, go and talk to your mates about, oh, do you know about this question, about this question, because you're not sure that you're gonna like upset other people because they might put like a complete different answer to you and it might make them feel down saying, oh, wow, I'm gonna do shit in this. It's not the end of the world if you do bad in what one exam. There's still other exams you can prove yourself that you are capable of passing. Well, um, after an exam when you get home, just don't straight away go back to revision and say, oh, I need to focus on the next exam. Just at least just chill out, just like have 30 minutes to yourself, like watch TV, do something like you usually do, like play games, put your mind off things for a bit. But obviously then uh, prepare for the next exam, like just revise a little bit for the next exam which is going to be on the next day. Okay, back to some useful tips now. So you can go into, uh, like there are some websites, well, when I was doing my exams in year 11, uh, there are a couple of good websites that helped me, for example, Bite Size, I put the link in the bio, in the bio as well. That's a very good website to help you uh, get the gist of things that actually help you understand what things are like. Another thing that helped me is uh, YouTube videos. I only like started that technique when it was like one week, two weeks to the exams. It really helped me a lot because I actually got some of the information. If I like, if I never actually thought of going to YouTube and look at the ideas and um, I mean, like, like help for the, like, the subjects and tests, I wouldn't actually done how I did. I would like done probably worse, but that's just for me. But it works for different other people. Like like I said at the beginning. Other people got different learning methods. I don't know what yours could be. You just have to like find out. But you probably might have found out now because like you're going for exam season and you've probably done a lot of tests since you started like year seven or something. Well, that was just my video for uh, exams. I know it's not much I can help you with because we like already through like go when like basically we are in exam season. There's not enough I can help you with, but. Uh, Keep streaming all my videos. Uh, well, I am, one of the ideas, what my mate said, is to go into, uh, I think it's town, and try and see if I can pull as much girls as I can. I am going to try that, because loads of people said, oh, please do it, please do it. So I am going to do that. It's just a matter of when I've, like, well, when I've got the time to actually go and do that. Also, uh, yeah, that's, yeah. No, I was just going to give a shout out to uh, some channels. Uh, Sean, obviously. He's got a good channel, Brant Gaming, amazing channel, and also someone who's, uh, I think he's just started YouTube, but he's got an amazing talent, he's, his name's Jamie Hogan, That's his, I think that's his name, yeah, uh, I'll try and tag his, uh, his YouTube channel's uh, link in the bio as well, so that's basically it, so don't forget to subscribe or press the like button if you like the video, and also, uh, Get my Instagram underscore ghost of 2017, my Snapchat, Anasu Wanchoto. 
yeah, so that's best it. Bye.